What's up, YouTube? This is a video on how to mod Dungeon Defenders for Xbox 360 with a USB stick. Um, so first you're going to have to download WinRAR, uh, Internal Crystal, and Modio. You could use Modio or Horizon. I prefer Modio because that's what I use. So you're going to need to put your game save onto your USB drive. Then put it into your computer or desktop, whatever. And then you're going to open up Modio. So, wait for this to open. Come on, any day now. Then you're going to go to open a save. Then up here to USB stick. And you're going to hit explore device. Content. You're going to see one with all these zero, 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 all those. Then one with letters and zeros. You're going to want to click the one with letters and zeros. Dungeon Defenders, Game Save, and it's going to pop up Done Def Save. So, what you're going to do is you're going to right click this, hit Save As, Save As Done Def Save. You're already, you can make a folder Done Def Save because you're going to, you're going to need to hit Save, and then it'll pop up already exists, so you got to replace it. Yes. And then what you're going to do is you're going to come over here to Internal Crystal. This takes a little bit to load, or never, never mind. <laughs> and then you're gonna come over here and double click this. Give it a minute. This is what takes a minute. Any day now. Sometimes you'll have to come up here and um, double click this, then come down here and double click this, double click this. There you go, this should pop up if you have Windows 8. Hit run anyway. Come on now. Here we go. Close this, the way you're gonna do is you're gonna hit open right here. Then a file should pop up. And then there'll be your done def save as, or whatever you save it in. And then you type it in the file name. Mine's already here because that's the only document that I have. So double click this. And it's gonna pop up bank and character. Alright, you're gonna go to your bank. Or you can go to character, whatever. This is where you mod your mana. The max is 200 million. And the only problem with this is it doesn't tell you what weapons that you're going to mod. Let's see, I can come over here to staff. I'm going to click on the actual staff. Then just mod all this stuff. The max is 128. 128. And just do that with all of them. And then fire, element damage. Oh, you got all this stuff. Item quality. Put it on legendary. The base damage right over here. Projectile, projectile speed. Attack speed, weapon range, range damage, clip size, reload speed, knockback, charge speed, uh, shots per second, item size. The item size, one is just normal, and then you put it on 20, and it'll be like the size of your tavern, and then your serial number. You come down here, edit the color, put the glow, whatever you want, and that's how you mod weapons and pets and stuff. Then you're just going to hit exit, then exit. And if you're going to mod a character, click characters. I only have two apprentices. So I'm going to come over here and mod your character and if you want to get it to glow, just put one solid color, whichever one you want. So just like, say I wanted red, put zero, zero, and then put this one to like two billion or whatever. It will just, it will do it by itself, the max. But then um, put zero right here and then the glow to like two billion. Then all you got to do after. Once you're done with the mod, like say I was to mod this character, level right here, put it 90, you could put it to like 15,000, or you could just do the XP right here. There you go. And then all you do is hit save. See, it'll pop up here. And, um, yeah, then you just exit out of everything. Uh, you, you, you should download WinRAR before you download Internal Crystal, because it's going to try to make you buy WinRAR. 
if you download Internal Crystal first, so um, just download WinRAR first. But um, other than that, I think that's it. This is my first video, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment if you have any questions, and um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.